The following program is brought to you by Kevin Shorey Ministries and our family of friends. Genesis 1 7. So God made the air and placed some of the water above the air and some below the air. You know, have you ever been in, into a, a service where there was nothing but hot air coming out from the preacher? It's not going to be today. We're going to have a great program, some great gospel music. David Brooks has come here with his old time gospel hour trio. And uh, I just, as he separates the water, he lets the river flow. The Spirit of God has been flowing since creation let the spirit of god flow through you today like this song says let the river flow let the river flow oh holy spirit come move in power let the river flow let the program roll roll it It's the Kevin Shorey Show! Take before a live studio audience at the Branson Mill in Branson, Missouri. Today, Kevin's special guest, David Brooks. Special music by the Old Time Gospel Hour Trio. And now, God said, roll it, and it was rolled. Here's your host, Kevin Shorey. Yeah, come on, isn't it a great day to serve the Lord? Welcome to the Kevin Shorey Show. Without any further do-do, do-do, no. Without any further ado, well, there's no do-do on this show either. Without any further time delay, here is, for the first time on the program, David Brooks is, is a norm here. He's a regular here. We love him. And uh, he has a trio. It's David Brooks, Marty Williams, Sue Phillips. It's the Old Time Gospel Hour Trio. Help us out. Going home with Jesus in the twinkling of an eye. I made my reservation for a mansion in the sky. I may not know the moment and I may not know the day, but I know that I'll be leaving when he calls his church away. I'm going home with Jesus in the twinkling of an eye. I made my reservation for a mansion in the sky. I may not know the moment and I may not know the day. To sound most any time And the crown of life is waiting Thank God will soon be mine I got my invitation At a place called Calvary By the precious blood of Jesus That trip's been paid for me I'm going home with Jesus In the twinkling of an eye I've made my reservation For a mansion in the sky I may not know the moment And I may not know the day when he calls his church away Well, the captain of the vessel Is calling it on board And your destination's heaven Safe on that golden shore Where we'll meet again our Savior And our loved ones who are gone There to live for all eternity Oh, yes, I'm going home I'm going home with Jesus In the twinkling of an eye And I may not go today, but I know that I'll be leaving when he calls his church away. Away. And I may not know today, but I know that I'll be leaving when he calls his church away. Away. You better sing it again. I better. Oh, the captain of the vessel is calling. Get on board. And our destination's heaven, safe on that golden shore where we'll meet again our Savior and the loved ones who are gone. 
there to live for all eternity. Oh, yes, I'm going home. I'm going home with Jesus in the twinkling of an eye. I made my reservation for a mansion in the sky. I may not know the moment and I may not know the day, but I know that I'll be leaving when he calls his church away. I may not know the moment and I may not know the day, but I know that I'll be leaving when he calls his church away. moment i may not know the day but i know one thing he's coming and i'm going home with jesus how about y'all you going home to jesus come on uh and it gets closer every day i just had a birthday in case you don't see that's some weird shot with not the whole desk or something but where's the whole desk shot there we go you can see it was my birthday here's why i know i got a birthday card but uh, and I got a bunch of birthday cards. When's your birthday, Dave? December fifth. December. So it's coming up. Coming up soon. <laughs> Another year older and deeper in debt right now. That's right. But man, you're keep, keeping busy for the Lord. I'm you're keeping not only busy. traveling all the churches and you're doing some local things, but you're on. You do a lot of ship work. Won't you come and take me on a sea cruise? Yeah. Sea cruise. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> Is that one of your songs? No, oh. I don't do that song. You're I on, should, but I should, don't. Yeah, you're I on a cruise. Do you should. Do you work for a certain cruise line? Or no, you, I don't. I do whoever all, will have you. All different lines. I do. Um, I have an agency out of Miami, and I go on everybody from princess to celebrity, uh, Holland America, you name it. Wow. Have, call me. I'll go. Call you go. I know. Call the number on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Since you started, I think you've been in every country I can ever think of. I, I think mean, so. You I, just came back from what Panama and, and uh, Bogota, in Colombia. Columbia, yeah, yep. And you know, I've been everywhere. I can literally say that like because Johnny Cash. I have been to. You do that song? No, I don't do that song either. <laughs> Uh, you know, the first one they ever sent me out on, I'm just going to tell a little story. The first one they ever sent me out on was to Turkey. And the, they, they dropped me off in the middle of town and they said, you go that way. And oh. I'm like, that's a little scary. Yeah. When you're blonde haired blue eyed, walking through the streets of turkey yeah istanbul like, that'll get you yeah. saved real quick yes well <laughs> you, know, you know jesus is coming yeah. amen god is good and how did you get the the gang together uh marty and, and sue and so well how i would like to say that this? i'm responsible for that but i'm not You're, i just walked in on them one day yeah and uh they let me start singing with them and uh that's what came out of it yeah we, i've been going we've we've been singing together probably going on about two years maybe yeah um, I love maybe the CD. a little over. Yeah, I love the CD, and I said I want that live. Now I've been begging you for a year. I know, and, uh, I know, I know. With your busy schedule, well, it's not just me. You know, you want to be the star. Yeah, like. well, that's not it. Everybody's got <laughs> things going on, and you know, it's just hard. You know, with Marty's work schedule, right. and you know, and then me not knowing where I'm going to be from week to week, and it's just I know. Chaos. Where are you heading to next? You know. Uh, well, I don't know next. I know I hear in a few weeks I'm going um, back down to the Caribbean, but I yeah. don't know. I mean, somebody's got to do it. Yeah, I know. But some, I may be leaving before then, so I don't. I have no yeah. idea. Do you have any things in, in Branson then uh, scheduled in the I don't. Future? I have a bunch of people asking. I, I probably will be setting something up, you know, like, awesome. uh, like a one-nighter. But right now, I don't. M maybe something in the works for next season. We'll see. Yeah. Um, well, churches when I'm call him because he will bless and inspire your church, too. You need to go out there. I have a good time. He will go out there. You need to have him is what I mean. And uh, now, next time you come on the program. Okay, make your list out. It's got to be Christmas. Okay. Yeah, I have a new Christmas Christ album coming out. You do? I do. Well, I do. see, a beautiful segue for that. I do. What's it called? What you doing with it? I'm, I'm, ca I'm, I'm calling it Jingle. Jingle. <laughs> all right. It's, it's got all the traditional fanfare on it, you know, White Christmas and um, Holly Jolly Christmas and all that. But I, I'm doing a couple of songs. I, I, Harry Connick Jr. wrote a beautiful uh, song called I Pray on Christmas that a lot of gospel artists have covered. I'm doing that song, but I'm super excited about um, I have a new song on there. Um, I don't know if you've heard it. Darius Rucker came out with it. What does God want for Christmas? Yes. What a great Love song. Love that song. And we're going to be doing that on there. Oh, well, you got to do that on here. Can I you, will. Can you do, oh. I can't do it today because I don't remember well, all the no, words. Well, no, no, we're not Christmas <laughs> yet. Most of Branson has gone Christmas now. Right, right. Uh, pretty much all of Branson has gone right. Christmas. But uh, we try to hold it till after Thanksgiving, you know, so well, you, you're, you'll be booked back. All okay, right? that so sounds like a plan. Come back. Go with your trio and go awesome. get ready. We're oh, going to sing again. Okay. And they're going to sing this other. It's a great song. I'm nearer home now than I was yesterday. And they're going to sing this song. And it's just such 
a blessing to have this trio. I love good old gospel music. I know you do too. So uh, you're going to enjoy this. And uh, he was talking about Christmas album. You know, our family of friends, partners this month, get a Christmas album. We've got another one that Jordan Kyle Band has been on our program a couple times with some of his favorite Christmas. And you don't have to ask for it, but if you'll sign up today, $34 a month as a family of friends, you can get my latest message uh, on the road that I preached uh, called The Power and the Second Touch of Jesus. And then the, then the Christmas CD, CD, DVD, all all kinds of great stuff. Are y'all ready, set up, ready to go? We're ready. All right. They're going, I'm going to try to get in three songs because I love this stuff. How many like some good old time gospel music? Yes. Well, you can find it here on the Kevin Shorey Show. Here they are again, the old time gospel hour trio.
truth. Thank you, thank you so much. They're going to come back and finish off the program with one more song. But, uh, you know, Christmas is coming up, and they have their CD. You can go to David's website, and you can find out how to, to uh, you saw their email address there. Go there to his website and to get their CD. We have CDs available. Go to our website at kevinshory.com, and you'll find different gifts. You know, we have our Friends of Israel ball cap that you can get, and we'll send everything we send is free shipping. This is Friends of Israel. This is the Star of David with the Cross. We're the only ones that carry that. We have our kids' armor. You know, this is great to just put in a stocking. This is a good stocking stuffer, but you've got kids and grandkids that on their cell phone day and night. Well, there are two devices in this box with all the material that shows you why you need these uh, devices. It's on the back of my phone right here. And kids like it. It looks like kind of a superhero shield, but it actually protects them from electromagnetic fields. I mean, you cannot tell me that from a satellite to a cell tower through a building to your phone, though there's not any kind of field or radioactive field that's going to hit your body. It, it definitely will. This is good for baby monitors as well. If that is monitoring sound from one room to the next and going through walls, all that, that stuff is zzz, all around. It can attack and, it, and uh, it can attack. It can attack. It actually, a cell phone put to your face boils the blood in your cheek and in your face and the, the uh, clinics. We have three different studies from Germany, Israel, and in America, the Jasper Clinic, that prove this. And a wonderful friend that invented this used some of God's materials, natural minerals and things. Uh, if I told you everything that's in it, I'd have to kill you. So just trust me, this is called Kids Armor because it will protect your kids, your grandkids from the electromagnetic fields caused by radiation and cell phone use. Put it on cell phones, baby monitors, laptops, desktops, and routers. You know, you got your router doing the, the internet all through your house. How can that not have some sort of electromagnetic fields? This repels it and moves it far away so that uh, you will not be harmed by that. Also, I got a call yesterday from Bruce's wife. I, I didn't write down her name. I forgot. But Bruce in Minnesota had, has a very se severe case of ongoing shingles. Shingles is caused by a virus, and it's moved into his eyes, where he used a medicine with steroids that eventually will cause the cataracts in his eyes. He is now with the doctor approved, and his pressure, blood pressure stabilized, off of it, all the medication and the steroids and the virus has been has disappeared from his eyes and the shingles gone because of another God made thing called silver. This is liquid silver. And they called in yesterday to get three more. We have the they're fifty dollars a bottle or three for one twenty five. They got the three fur. We call it the three fur there and the silver, which attacks, you know, natural silver attacks bacteria, virus, and fungus. She said she had bought other silvers from other different uh sources and none of them worked like our sacred silver because this is more absorbent and it's more alkaline they have treated it so that it is more natural and more alkaline so it absorbs into your body and helps you we want to help and be a blessing but as you donate we'll give this to you to say thank you and it helps us to do what we're doing and spreading the gospel and the good news isn't that a good trade-off isn't that great yeah. it's a program you, you clap Susan. We just, I, maybe I, I don't have the sign, but I can always tell people, give me a hand. There we go. And so where are we going to give you a hand? Thank you. All right. Y'all need some silver. Y'all are falling asleep. That's what it is. But uh, there's a silver liquid or the silver gel. Go to kevinchoy.com or call 844-47-KEVIN. Or if you're in Branson, come on by our studio. We keep it here in stock as well as everything else from T-shirts and our Kevin Choi Show mug because every beverage tastes better in a Kevin Choi Show mug. But here's the doctor that put together the silver and he'll tell you about it right now. Here's Dr. Gordon Pedersen. Hello, my name is Dr. Gordon Pedersen. My mission is to help lift people physically, spiritually, and mentally. I believe the body will heal itself if you give it the proper tools. Dr. Pedersen is board certified in anti-aging and regenerative medicine. He has four medical doctorate degrees in areas of clinical, research, naturopathic, and wound care. He has worked under Jonas Salk, the American medical researcher noted for the discovery of the polio vaccine. 
Dr. Pedersen is the medical director of the Silver Health Institute. I want you to recognize the history of silver. It's part of our mission statement to recognize that a thousand years ago, silver was nothing more than a coin thrown into a barrel to inhibit bacterial growth. A hundred years ago, the new ionic forms and colloids were starting to show up and they got a lot of really good benefits, medically speaking. Then in the last 10 years, there has been new aquasol technology and even patents have been developed throughout this time period. But now at the Silver Health Institute, we're identifying new and improved forms of silver. Not just aquasols, not just colloids or ionics, but actual structured silver with benefits like alkalinity so that your body can use it every single day. As you can see, I'm proud to help re research and deliver the new and improved message of the new and improved silver. In fact, these silvers are being studied at the pharmaceutical levels. A pharmaceutical company called Nelson Labs has tested them and found that the new and improved structural alkaline silver outperforms all the rest. This is significant because it's a silver designed for your body to be used every single day. And we're back. Thank you, Dr. Patterson. Uh, you know, our goal is to not have commercials and push product as much as, you know, because we think that all of God's people to work together, we can get some. That's why we ask for you to be, become our monthly family of friends. Also, family of friends, today, tomorrow, it's your last chance. Email us. Get to our website, find our email, which is Kevin Shorey, uh, K Shorey Min at AOL.com, and uh, email us your recipes because we're offering our new Kevin Shorey Show cookbook next month, and it can't happen without everybody doing it together. So send us in your favorite recipes. Make sure your name is included so we can give you credit and your address so we can send you your, the cookbook. Also, we want to keep decorating the soapbox. I'm getting on my soapbox. we got some laundry soap signs, and uh, it even says soapbox on my box here. But send us an empty box of detergent, and we'll put your name on it. An empty box of detergent or, or empty uh, soap wrapper. We won't cover this with all that stuff. I could go get it. But you know what? I thought maybe you, know, you can contribute, be a part of the set and part of the program. At the beginning of the program, I said uh, Genesis 1-7. Genesis 1-7 says he took the waters and he separated it from the heavens, from the air, and he begins to separate. He will separate you and take you from the things that do not belong to you, and he wants to give you uh, rivers of living water. How do I know that? Here's what Jesus said himself, John 7, 37, 38, 39. Jesus said, if anyone thirsts, let him come to me and drink, anyone. Anyone, he doesn't say you have to be this kind of person, you have this background or, you know, anyone. Let anyone who thirsts come to me and drink. He who believes in me and as, does as the scripture says, out of his heart will flow rivers of living water. He's still separating us from evil with the power of the Holy Spirit and moving the waters. And he wants rivers of living water. What does that mean? Well, at verse 39, this he spoke concerning the Holy Spirit, who those believing in him will receive. At this time, the Holy Spirit says was not yet given because Jesus was not yet glorified. But the good news is he is now given the Holy Spirit. He is now glorified and the rivers of living water are available to you. All you say is, Jesus, I, I've been lost. I've been wrong too long. I'm a sinner, but you're a savior. Come in by the power of your Holy Spirit and let those rivers of living water flow through me. I think in my case, it would be oceans of living water flowing through me. Me, that was a fat joke, wasn't good. But you know what? God is real and he wants to change you. He is the answer for this world today. He is your answer for everything that you're facing today. Let him take you on his river. Like Ezekiel said, I lost control in the river of God. Go into the river of God and go forward in the great things God has for you. And then you'll know what we talk about when every day at the end of the program we say this, Jesus is the answer for our world today. And on top of that, you can sing this song. Here is the old time gospel hour trio to close out with one of my favorite Happy Goodman songs. Wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. We'll see you tomorrow. You know, the world will offer you a lot of things, a lot of silver and a lot of gold. But if I could still, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. <laughs> I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. Ain't nothing 
in the world that'll ever take the place of God's love. Silver and gold couldn't buy his touch from above. Oh, when my soul needs a healer, and I begin to feel his power. I can say I thank the Lord I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. Oh, no, well, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. I gotta make it to heaven somehow. Oh, the devil hit me and he tried to turn me around. Still, I wouldn't make nothing for my journey now. Oh, I was and I traveled for the Lord many years ago. And I had a lot of heartache and I met a lot of grief and woe. Oh, but when I would stumble there, I could humble down. Say I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. Oh no, well, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. I gotta make it to heaven somehow. Oh, the devil take me and he tries to turn me around. He's over everything that's got a name, all the wealth I want. And world fame, if I could still, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. Well, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. I gotta make it to heaven somehow. Oh, the devil bit me and he tries to turn me around. He's over everything that's got a name, all the wealth I want. And world of fame, if I could still, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. If I could still, I wouldn't take nothing for my journey Promotional consideration paid for by Meyer Hotels. Guests of the Kevin Shorey Show stay at the Best Western Center Point Inn. It's Branson's top hotel in the heart of Branson's Entertainment next to the Titanic Museum. Relax in the indoor pool and hot tub. The hotel offers a variety of room types. Enjoy the free hot breakfast every day. For more information or to make reservations, call 1-877-334-1894. The world-famous Branson Mill at 3300 North Gretna Road, where art meets entertainment. Featuring the corner store studio, friendly staff, hundreds of shops, demonstrations, crafts, snacks, classes, artwork, fun for all ages, the Treehouse Cafe. All under one roof at the world famous Branson Mill where art meets entertainment. The preceding program was brought to you by Kevin Shorey Ministries and our family of friends.